in the world now, virginity for the ungodly is what? Virginity for the ungodly is what? Not being smart. Again? Not, not being what? Enlightened. Yes? Again? I'm, citing, I'm getting us to think. When you say you are still a virgin, and the world hear it, what do you think they think about? They think what about you? They think it's not exposed. Are we still together? But when we talk about virginity to the godly, what is that? Praise God. <laughs> to the godly now is what? Is, according to Pastor Peace, is a thing of joy. <laughs> All right, again. Is a virtue. Beautiful. I love that. Is a virtue. What else again? <laughs> Praise God. But for the ungodly, they say, ah, something is worse. Ah. Something is wrong with you. They say you are not okay. In fact, they begin to tell you that if you are having one sickness or the other, it's because you are, you are still a virgin. That you are, you are still a virgin. That you need somebody to go and to come and break the gate for you. <laughs> That's the, 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 the way of the ungodly is that they don't see anything sinful. Any, they don't see crime in what we call virtue. Have you not had things like people do that? People do it now. Eh? It's no matter. For the ungodly, sin is what, sir? It's a normal life. For the godly, sin is what, sir? It's a sin. It's not normal. 